guys, Storm's Inc. here, and I want to give you my opinion on Titanfall. I was finally able to go play this game. I rented it out of the Red Box for, uh, you know, like two bucks, whatever it is, the game the Red Box. I am not buying an Xbox One for this game. I refused to buy an Xbox One for this game, so I waited for it to be released on the Xbox 360. So lucky for me, I spent $5 instead of 500 and thank God for that, because to be honest, this game isn't really worth that much money. Okay, Titanfall is a fun game, yeah, it's okay, but it's, it's a game that, that's extremely boring after a while, and is extremely easy. It's the only game I played where half the damn players in the game are bots. They're not, they're artificial characters. They're not really playing with people online. The time I spent, and I'm going to tell you this, I suck at first-person shooters. Love them, but suck at them, okay? I love Halo. I can play Call of Duty just fine with my friends. I suck at both those games. My KD never reaches over 1. I'm always like a .75, a .69, something of that nature. My KD in this game is almost a 3.0. This game is too damn easy. One game, I had 40 kills and 4 deaths. You know why? Because 75% of the players on this game are bots. You play team deathmatch, okay? You, you play matchmaking, you have your team, you have the other team, and there's real people playing that team. But to make the game more interesting, or what's supposed to be interesting, is they add bots on both sides of the team. So, you can either go try to hunt down the real people, or you can just sit there and, and shoot the bots. It doesn't matter. A kill is a kill. It all equals up to the winning of the game. No lie, I spent one time just, I was sitting there aiming my gun. And a whole team just spawned right in front of me. So, I shot them all. Like, like I was just sitting there. Right, I was getting ready to call my Titan, and a whole team just spawned right in front of me. It was like six people. I threw a grenade out there, and just pop, 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 pop. They're all dead. You know? I mean, it's extremely easy to play. If people love this game because it's easy to play, then they got problems. Because as much as I crack on Call of Duty and say Call of Duty is an idiot game, and by idiot game, I mean any person can pick it up and play it. It's a casual game. It's not for hardcore players, even though there's a lot of hardcore players out there, but a lot of people like to just pick it up and play. Like, like friends come over, oh, we playing Call of Duty, let me try, and they'll get a couple kills. This game, you can go, you can do the same method and go, oh, all right, let me play, and get 40 kills. I suck at first-person shooters, and this game makes me look like I'm MLG. Um, another thing I don't like about it is... There's no actual campaign. There's a, like, the game is all online multiplayer. There's a campaign, but it's basically the same shit you're playing online. And I just don't like that. It's almost like this game really didn't put no effort into it. And the one thing that is the most, the most disliked about this game, the thing I'm, I'm disliked the most, are the Titans. The thing that, you, that you're supposed to enjoy is the least favorite thing about the game. I had my friend and my brother over yesterday, and we're playing this game because they, they wanted to play this for a while. And they came over, we played for about three hours, and all of us averaged like 35 fucking kills. And it, none of us, toward the end, were using the Titans. Because it, it's easier just to run around and cap people instead of fucking with the Titans. Yeah, every now and then we get bored, we'll jump on a Titan and try to destroy the Titan, but we never really call it our Titan. And the Titans are mostly like a kill streak. Everybody gets a Titan, okay? Doesn't matter how many kills you get, you're gonna get a Titan. It just depends on how fast your Titan comes. It's sort of like an ordinance drop. You know, you'll be sitting there fighting that thing, you know, they'll be like, Titan ready. And you press like down on the D-pad and your Titan will drop just like an ordinance drop from Halo. And speaking of Halo, a lot of this game reminds me of Halo. Hell, the opening screenshot where it shows all these ships in front of this planet is ripped right from Halo. Even my brother said, okay, I got to give you that one. That's a straight ass rip off of Halo. The only thing missing from that screenshot was the Halo logo. But... Overall, the game is fun to play if you're drunk and you have friends over, but this is not a game that I want to drop $60 for to play by myself 
and play all the time. And I, I, I really pity anybody, anybody who paid $500 for an Xbox One just to play this game. Because I guarantee you, when Call of Duty comes out this year, everybody's going to be jumping back on that bandwagon. This game is not going to sustain that much uh, fan base for long. It's just that, one, it's not selling that well. I guess people, it, the cats out of the bag, people realize this game is not what everybody's making it out to be. I don't know where all these reviews are coming for, where this game is getting nines and tens and all this shit, because the game is not all that in a bag of potato chips. I don't know if they paid reviewers off. Knowing Microsoft, I wouldn't fucking blame them, because they need to sell some consoles. But this game... It's fun to play with a bunch of friends, okay? You just don't care. But this is not a game you're going to get with your friends in every day and play and keep your attention involved in this game. This game is too damn simple. The mechanics is is just too damn simple to run. you got no comp campaign to keep you interested past that. And overall, the Titans is just a mumbled mess. Just having all the Titans on there is just a mumbled mess. It would make more sense if they did something else with the Titans. Like, each side has one Titan. But to have everybody have a Titan and half the time the Titans are just worthless... It, this well, The point I'm trying to make, people, is this is not the saving grace for the Xbox One. I wouldn't be surprised if you guys see this exact title on the PS4 up, you know, coming within the next year or so. Because it's not selling on the Xbox One, and for good reason. For everything that I just uh, said in this video. Um, did I have a fun time playing it? Yeah, sure. But it's not something I'm going to miss once I return it. So until next time, guys, I'm Storm Zane, and this has been Titanfall.